Hello and welcome again to my channel. Um, today I bring you very exciting tool and technology that I think would really make a difference in um in the way we build um embeddable tools and the way web pages are built, email and um, landing pages are built, and this is Grips Jazz. So um there is three three parts to, to what we want to discuss today. Our main focus will be on the two parts, but it's important that I explain to you a bit of how these things are related. So we are looking at Grapes.js. So what is Grapes.js? To easily understand what Grapes.js is, um, we will we'll move to, let's go to the Grapes.js docs. So Grapes.js is, um, is a, a page builder or HTML builder. But here is the difference. It's a bit different from the normal HTML or page builder you already know. Uh, for example, they point out to the fact that you can embed this into your own stuff. So if you if you feel like you want to build a page builder, this becomes a framework for you to build your own um, page builder, you see. And now something else that um, they say that makes this a bit different from many other page builder is the fact that um, you you have total control of the system. After all, you, you build everything thing from the scratch and they give you the tool to build this uh, from the scratch um if you check out the blog here that was written by the ceo um uh, this particular one uh, grips and grips js and beyond introducing grips um studio um and our plans for the future i think it is this one uh, one of these I, I read it and it gives you um a, a big picture of how they are really different from every other uh, page builder out there so one good thing is it, it doesn't have add like an overload onto your system um, it doesn't use an iframe it's something you can easily embed into your system and have total control of of it so here at the grips js um uh, docu uh, documentation you can find all the tools that you need to build your own page builder uh, from from scratch everything is given to you here the components the blocks the assets and all of that now, I've introduced this to you for you to understand the background of what we'll be talking about today. Our main focus is not on Grapejs, but on products that have been built on Grapejs by Grapejs company. I don't know if you get my point here. So when we turn back, we'll come back to the main website here that we, we are focusing on. It is Grapejs, but there are two tools that we'll be looking at aside from this. So let's come back to our, um, our curriculum. So this is our curriculum, by the way. You know, I use curriculums these days to guide us through what we'll be discussing. So um, we'll be looking at Grips.js, which we've already done. And then we'll be looking at um, what is Grips.js Studio and then what is Grips.js Studio SDK. So these are three different things and I need to help you understand the difference between these uh, three. So um, I'm, I'm, let me check out the intro. I've already introduced this. So let's look at the difference between Grips.js Grips JS Studio and then Grips JS Studio SDK. All right. So let's come back here. And once again, I said that Grips JS is the framework on which you can build um, other um, page builders because um, Grips JS gives you all the tools that you need. Right. Now, the next thing is what is now Grips JS Studio. So Grapejs Studio is um, the, the, a platform that has been built on top of this. Um, Grips.js that helps you to build HTML landing page, web pages or email pages on the fly. So um, when you come back to this landing page here, which is Grapejs.com and click on this try um, editor, it takes you to a studio here that where that have all the tools that you'll be needing to build out a particular web page. Now I, I've already started editing, you know, build something out, uh, on this, uh, which I'll delete and we'll rebuild um, together. But this is what you are supposed to land on top whenever you get to that page. So I had to use a different browser to open this so that you see what you should be expecting when you land on this page. So like I said, this is a landing page builder. It helps you um, to build. Now, um, after building, you have full control because you can easily generate the code that um, you have um, been able to build um, based on the drag and drop that um, you've used so far. There is the HTML, there's the CSS. So you can easily generate this code and take it to um, your best editor and then start doing some more configuration and all that. And then you are able to build out something really cool in a very short amount of time. Now, it's not just that you're able to build out something cool. You also have full control of it, unlike 
um, most no code tools that you would not have control over um, the code. And that might become frustrating when you <clears throat> are trying to build out um, or make certain corrections um, that might be a bit difficult to do using the drag and drop um, that has been given to you. All right. So I've been able to explain um, two things now. One is Grapes.js and the other is Grapes.js Studio. Now, the third one is Grapes.js Studio SDK. So uh, what, what, what do we mean when we talk about Grapes.js Studio SDK? Now, that for me seems to be um, the phone of this whole thing and the, the main juice that we'll be talking about um, in a bit. But this is basically... Um, the tool that has been given to developers by Grapes.js to be able to add these page builders into their own application. So once again, it's not the first page builder that you see out there, but this really makes sense because they give you a lot of control um, over how you build um, or add page builders into your application. And um, it, it does not have add unnecessary weight on top of your application. And um, you have total control over how you can configure everything your users will be able to do when you add this. So it, it makes it really a game changer and makes it really different. I'll be walking you through this documentation in a bit. Uh, but first thing we'll be doing is to go and see how to use this page builder to build a basic um, landing page. I uh, will not be building out a full landing page, but I'll get you started with how to build this and um, basic things you need to know uh, in building a landing page. So um, let's go back to our curriculum here and check this off. And next is how to use the Grip Studio 